and I'll take care of them. <laughs> no, I'm the better shot, and you, you're the better actor. No, you play dead, and I'll cover you. <laughs> Oli kolmi sormis mai, oli reikä rauta braun. Ja tapahtuma paikana oli Jackson Willie Town. Hello, mister. How can I help you? I'll take a paper, please. Sure you come back tomorrow. Here it is, folks. All the news you need. Mr. Morgan. You still here, kid? Yes. Mama. Mama can't leave. Or won't leave. I, I don't know. I said I had the money. It, she said your money weren't moral. She said it'd be better to die than to take it. <laughs> Maybe she's right. I don't know. I don't know anything about morals. She's still heading out. Working, you know? I'm sorry, son. Sorry about all of this. She ain't been back for a few hours. She left with some fellow down the railway tracks. I did not like the look of him. Which way, you say? Uh, that way. Around the woods, towards uh, Willard's Rest. I'll see what I can do. Nice out here, huh? It's quiet. Nice? Sure. Feller could do what he likes out here. I guess. I mean, you think I'm a nice man, dearie? A kind man? Sure. I ain't always 
nice. That's enough now, partner. You're starting to scare me, let alone the poor woman. Clear off. Who are you? Someone who don't want to hear no more of your nasty mouth. Push me. I'll put a bullet in you. I, I presume Archie sent you? I said clear off before I deal with you. I'll see you again, dearie. Mm. Listen. Listen to me. <coughs> Excuse me. You sound like my husband. I know. Listen, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what happened. I was uh, a fool. And I'm suffering for my foolishness. But don't go and get yourself killed because of your pride. You have a son, Mrs. Downs. I'm just so ashamed. Ashamed? <laughs> of what? <laughs> you loved him. <laughs> you did everything for him. <laughs> Let's get you home. <laughs> All right. Let's go. I'm sorry I had to come to this. Stop saying sorry. Sorry won't bring Thomas back. I know. <laughs> so you're sick now, too? And you think that affords you the opportunity for penance for cutting his time short? No. I ain't looking for that. Okay, then. So just forget about me and the guilt you're carrying, because no good can come of that for either of us. And all you can do now is decide the man you want to be for the time you have left. Have someone who can still be helped. Why help yourself? I suppose you're right. Oh, hang yourself for all I care. You're right to dislike me. I ain't looking for that to change. She should be waiting for us just up ahead. Mama! Mama! Oh, oh. oh you're so important here. Oh, Archie, what do we do? Get out of here. Go. Live someplace else. Start over. Here, take this. I don't need it no more. I don't want your money. Yeah, I know you don't want it. I don't. You sure as shit need it. Take it. No. I ain't looking for forgiveness. It ain't about that. But don't forgive me. Just take the money and get out of here. Please. I know I ruined your life. I suffer for it every day. But don't let yourself get killed for, for pride. I've seen it kill too many folk. <sighs> don't say anything. Don't thank me. Just take the money and pack your bags. That's all I got to say. Thank you, Mr. Morton. I said don't thank me. Get out of here. Please.
supposed to be our little adventure. <laughs> uh, you all right there? Who are you? Oh, it's okay, ma'am. I don't mean you no harm. <laughs> well, it makes no difference now. If, if an outlaw or a wild animal doesn't get me starvation, well... We came out here from the city in search of a different life. Something true, something real. All this squandering and indulgence, we wanted to strip it away, to find something authentic. <laughs> what a pair of fools. Is there a... Train station or a town I can take you to? No, I can't give up now. He wouldn't want that. I, I can't have it. I'm gonna do this for you, Cal. Well, I'll, um, I'll leave you to it. Is there anything left for you to eat? Nothing. No, we didn't know the first thing about hunting. We couldn't even catch a darn mouse. If you need any poisonous berries, though, I'm a natural at finding those. Well... You ain't gonna last much longer out here if you don't know how to hunt. Come on. I'll show you. All right. But you better not try any funny business. You know, I may be weak, but I still know how to stand up for myself. Oh, I don't doubt it. Come on. Tell me, you ever skin an animal before? No, but then again, I haven't caught much of anything either. Well, you'll need to know how to do both if you're gonna survive out here. I am all too aware. So where should we head for? Uh, let's try in the trees down there, near the river. What happened to your husband, if you don't mind me asking? A bear got him. It was horrifying. He survived, but only for a couple of days. I, I buried him a week ago. Uh, I'm sorry. This was really his dream more than mine. I'd have hopped the next train back to Chicago if he'd said the word. But now, I, I don't know. It's hard to explain. I have to do this. Uh, I understand. Yes. This is a good spot. What are we looking for? Well, I... I think we should start with something small, don't you? I kill it, you skin it. Sound fair? Skin it? But I, I, I don't even have a knife with me. Well. Look, a rabbit. Right there. Shot. Okay then, go on. Time to get your hands dirty. How do I... I mean... 
What do I do? Just hold the legs tight and pull the skin away quickly. Should come right off. To it. You did good. I think I've seen enough blood for one day. <laughs> Do you mind if we head back now? Sure. I'll walk you back. You did good. That should keep you fed for a few days. Oh, yes. At least. Thank you so much. I mean, this really ain't such a bad spot. You got a good water source. It's remote, but we can survive here all right. I have no doubt that one can survive here. Whether Charlotte Balfour can is a different matter entirely. You've probably lived your whole life in the outdoors. Oh, a lot of it, that's for sure. I barely left the city before coming here. Cal spent his summers growing up at his grandparents' lodge in Maine, but I get the impression they did more punting than hunting. Right. Oh, Lord. No. We're done for now. Whoa, stay back. To smell the dead rabbit. What are we going to do? Oh you see, if, if, if you hadn't been here, I, I'd be dead now. You got a rifle? Yes. Well, my, my husband's. I suggest you learn how to use it. Now, come on, let's get you home. Since we got here, it feels like every step forward has come with a hundred steps back. People always talk about the simplicity of country life, but there is nothing simple about any of this. I suppose I'll just have to wait for you here, then. Well, uh, I guess we only know what we know. Oh, please. I'm sure it wouldn't take you too long to adjust to a life of privilege and indolence in the big city. I don't know about that. It sounds off. Oh, it is. A truly empty and boring existence. But an undeniably easy one. I still can't believe he's gone. Follow me, boy. Stay here, boy. Thank you. That was the first time anyone's done anything nice for us. For me, since we got here. Well, nature provides, but she sure don't always make it easy. That she doesn't. I'd invite you in, but I'm dead on my feet, if you'll forgive the pun. <laughs> Please do call again sometime, though. A good rest, and hopefully I'll be a new woman. You take care, man.
there he is. Old Black Lung Morgan. Shut up. Was you followed? Excuse me? Was you followed? Do you know who you're talking to? I ain't sure. I ain't sure about much no more. All I know is there's law whenever you're around. Is that so? Because mm. it seems to me that since you've been riding with us, there ain't been nothing but trouble. Stirring things up all the time, getting in Dutch's ear. Seems wherever you is, there's Pinkertons and vice versa. So you better watch your goddamn mouth, boy. <laughs> or... <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, cowboy. You're gonna do yourself a mischief, way your head. Micah, shut it. He started it. <sighs> Dutch says we is to go on with plans to create a diversion. We gotta get some explosives to blow up the bridge. Keep the army out of here a few days. I think it's a real bad idea. I don't think Dutch cares too much what you think. That's clear. We gotta confuse him one last time. Then he and I will head to Blackwater, collect the money, and help everyone leave. He's got a boat lined up. Blackwater's a fool's errand. Everyone knows it. Even a greedy moron like you. It's Dutch's choice, Arthur. You're just a senior gun, same as the rest of us. Only you ain't well. I'm fine. Then you'll do Dutch's bidding, which is robbing a stage that's coming from Annisburg full of explosives. Rob a stage. All we seem to ever do is rob a stage, you and me. Not me. You two. I got my own planning to do. You boys got this. Shit. Guess we have. Come on, Arthur. And cowpoke. You take it easy. You could do with a vacation. Hmm? <coughs> <laughs> says we should jump it as soon as it comes through Van Horn. So you're taking orders from him now? I'm taking orders from Dutch. Same as always. The pair of them are becoming unhinged. You hear about Dutch killing Cornwall? Hey, hold up a second. Pinkerton patrol over there. Come on, dig those spurs in. Okay, I think we're clear. Let's head off. So, you were saying? Well, that needed to be done. Right now? With the Pinkertons breathing down our necks? See, I'm starting to think that you've gone soft, Morgan. Hold up here. So, wagon will be coming from that way, down from Annisburg. And it'll take the two of us to stop it completely, or it'll never get done. So, I was thinking, you go play dead, and I'll take care of him. <laughs> no, I'm the better shot, and you, you're the better actor. No, you play dead, and I'll cover you. I got that. I got that. Oh, that's them coming now, I think. It'll be quite the show.
Let's see if we can get this back to camp without blowing ourselves up. sense to you it's a distraction so it ain't meant to make sense it should to us it's our plan you know i've had it with a moment yep What's wrong, Arthur? Nothing at all, boss. John, go drive this over to Bacchus Bridge. Get a hidden near there. He really does think Bill, he's in charge. You go on ahead. I need to speak with Arthur. Good work, son. What's going on? Listen. I know we ain't always seen eye to eye, and uh, you find me irritating and a threat, and I like to annoy you. But right now, I need better from you, Arthur. Okay, Micah. Whatever you say. I ain't the bad guy you think I am, Arthur. But I am a survivor. Stick with me and you'll live. Oh, the bridge is probably a two-man job. You should probably go help Marston. Why don't you? Like I said, Dutch and I got planning to do for the train. 
There's a big picture here, Arthur. Trust me. 